science today. Dr. Gladys Dogposture, PhD in Bar of the Ethel Spriggs Institute of Awfully Advanced Studies, continues his lecture on DNA. Uh, uh, good evening. In the last 640 programs, <laughs> I've been trying to tell you a little about that thread of life which we scientists call DNA, or deoxyribose nucleic acid. Altogether, Deoxyribose nucleic acid. Good, yes. Uh, now, DNA is the uh, genetic unit that controls the way in which each individual cell is formed. It's, it's, it's rather like having a lot of building sites linked by a vast telephone exchange, all controlled by an enormous invisible traffic policeman which we scientists call P.C. Harris. <laughs> now, uh, here is a model of a DNA molecule. We scientists have found a way of altering this molecule in real life. We can, as it were, uh, turn it upside down, <laughs> or, to put it another way, <laughs> this means that uh, we scientists can now change and alter the very shape of life itself. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Obviously, this is very important in the field of germ warfare because we scientists can now produce an almost infinite number of new diseases. <laughs> thank you very much. We can now make germs or bacteria, G E R M S, <laughs> to order. Here in Britain, we have recently made a major breakthrough by producing a new, extremely large germ. A germ so large that it can kill a man by acts of physical violence. <laughs> we scientists have nicknamed this germ the extremely large germ. <laughs> but more correctly, we refer to it as the Big Strangler, after Dr. Big Strangler, the biologist. <laughs> Here is a picture of it as it would look if it were a small germ magnified. <laughs> yes. And here to give you some idea of his true size is a picture of the big strangler as it would look standing next to Nelson's column. Here he comes. <laughs> the, uh, thank you. Yes. the big strangler will also be able to kill people by kneeing them in the head. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. I would now like to finish with a song. Bye. This is no one looking. <laughs> <laughs> Oi, he's been Tom, get out of it, or I'll smash your face with a bunch of pies. <laughs> Remember when these buns was two for a penny? Oh, yes. Mind yeah. you, a penny was worth something then. Oh, yeah, yeah. 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 Well, <laughs> I can remember when you could get a dozen buns for a halfpenny. Yes. For a <laughs> but no, you halfpenny was worth something in them days, yeah. wasn't it? Yes, it was. I mean, yeah. for halfpenny, yeah. you could buy ten fags, mm. <laughs> ounce of shag, yes, yes, yes. pint of beer, Seventeen-course meal you could buy. <laughs> Twenty-nine-course meal, actually. Three hundred and sixty-four-course meal. <laughs> Four thousand nine hundred and sixty-three-course meal with champagne. Yeah. <laughs> All for eight me. Yeah. What? And still have change. Yes, yes, yes. You'd have a farthing change. Oh, you'd have, oh yeah? yes. Mind you, a farthing was worth more. Farthing was yes, worth it was more. more. You could have a fortnight in Margate for a farthing. Oh, you can have a month up Monte Carlo. A flutter on the check. Yes, 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 y
Well, nothing was worth more in them days, didn't it? Yes, it was. Ten times as much nothing was worth. 753 yes. times as much more nothing was worth. I remember that. Yes, for yes. nothing. Yes. For nothing. Yes. Yes. You could have a blowout. Big meal at the Trocadero restaurant. Trocadero. Oh, oh, hey, 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 hey. Yes, yes. And you could have the Royal Box at the Alhambra Musical. The Alhambra Musical. Oh. Do you remember the stars? What stars? The stars. Microphones? Microphones? They had strong voices. Strong voices, strong voices you see. Yeah. You could hear Mary Lloyd <laughs> at the back of the gallery. You oh. could hear Nelly Wallace <laughs> outside in the street. <laughs> you could hear Vesta Chili and Western Super Mayor, you could hear. <laughs> you could hear Gertie Gatana in New Zealand. <laughs> Even when she wasn't singing. <laughs> Yes. 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 Huge bosoms, I I was. Don't you talk to me about out to here. Out to here, they were. Out to here, they were. Huge bosoms, they were. Huge Oh, dear. But tiny little waist. Oh, 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 Teeny, weeny, back here! They had moral standards then. Yes, I did. And huge bosoms, I think. Yes, yes. I tell you, living, living, yes. living, living was, living was living then. Yes, it if was. If you had three halfpence in your pocket, three halfpence, yes. three halfpence in your pocket, yes. the world was your oyster. It was. You had your choice of women with huge, huge bosoms. Yes. 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 Trip round the world on your own. Yes. Yes. Diamonds, typings, oh. bathing champagne, oh. your own luxury villa up to south of France. Yes, live in luxury for the rest of your life. Yes, oh. all for nothing. Huh. Yes, and still have change. <laughs> Mind you, there was another side to it. It was, it was, what? quite true, oh, yeah. quite true. Yeah. Yeah. It was a different matter if you was poor. Yes. Oh, tiny, tiny little, little bosoms. bosoms. Yes. 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 Yes.